Thank you. Happy New Year to uh, Iranian.com <laughs> readers and viewers. And viewers. And what? And viewers. Viewers, I said. Viewers. Um, mm. Yeah, really, truly happy New Year. It's uh, it's a great start to the year, apart from the weather here in Europe, which is taking a bit of a battering. Um, but otherwise, we're we're all okay. And. I just wanted to say that, uh, first of all, where's Mummy, boys? Where is Mummy today? She's gone to Bikram Yoga. She's gone to Bikram Yoga. Bikram Yoga is one of those, in case you don't know, high-impact yoga uh, classes where they have the temperature in the room at nearly 35, 40 degrees. And what that does is it makes you sweat profusely, and the moves they make you do um, are so high-impact, you think your heart's going to burst out of your chest. I, I uh, go... I've been, but um, only so I can get into position behind the Japanese ambassador's daughter, which is a great place to be during yoga. Anyway, um, what's wrong? Siavash, can you give him some water as well, please, darling? Thank you. So, um, what's new? Well, I'll tell you what's new. And JJ, actually, this is really for you. Uh, to please consider, if you're interested, I mean, I don't think it's going to be a competition anymore because I started this on uh, Boxing Day, which is my diet. And I've, I've started this diet, which is a really simple diet. I just eat less. I haven't stopped eating anything. I just eat less of it. So, I still have my toast and butter, my coffee, my roast chickens, rice, etc. But I eat a ton less. So that, after my toast and coffee in the morning, at lunchtime I might have a few slices of cheese or chicken or whatever I like eating at lunchtime. But in smaller amounts. It sounds like a really tough thing to do, to eat less. They always say one of the really hard things about giving up smoking and, and, and going on a diet is that with smoking, you're able to cut something out. And that's it's far easier to cut something out than it is to, to do less of something that you're addicted to. Do. So, so dieting is, is, is real. For those of you who know, and maybe those of you who don't appreciate it, it is really, really tough to change your habit by reducing the intake of something rather than cutting something out completely. But what has enabled me to do this is... Can you be... Boys, boys, I'm talking, I'm talking. What has, what has, what has enabled me to do this is very simply a decision, tasmin. A decision that I want to be thin. Not that I'm going to lose weight. Not about the process. It's about the end goal. It's the outcome. And the outcome, my wish, my desire, is to be not skinny or whatever, but just to be thin again and be able to get into size 34-inch waist pants and maybe even 32-inch uh, waist pants instead of scrabbling around in gap trying to find 42 waist. Can you stop that, Grush, there? Trying to find 42 waist, which doesn't quite fit, and then ordering 44. Don't do that again or I'll burst your balloon. 44 waist uh, from Gap Online. And it's ridiculous. And they don't, you know, fit me that well anyway, and I look ridiculous in them. And I'm just tired of doing that. I'm 42 and I want to wear nice clothes. But it's not, it's also not about vanity. I just want to be healthy from the point of view of the joint ache and the aches and pains. I asked you not to do that, didn't I, darling? I'm talking. I'm not hitting you, I'm hitting me. I know, I don't care who you're hitting. Um, so, what I want to do is to lose weight so I can also be healthier. Now, in case you're wondering, oh, he wants to live to see his kids uh, get married and all that kind of stuff, of course, that's a bonus. But it's not my motivator. My sister would always say to me, don't you want to live to see your kids go <coughs> bollocks to that? It's important. You need to, I mean, it's supposed to be a motivator. But not when you have difficulty dieting. It's just not on your 
on your radar as, a, as an issue. But I think when you make a decision, and we'll come to how you make that decision in a second, it, everything else just seems to fall into place. You just eat less. You don't feel that hungry. You, you begin to enjoy the sensation of hunger. Now, to get to that stage, what you need to do is spend four or five days eating as little as possible. Don't change your diet. Just eat as little as you possibly can. Maybe even measure out in the morning. Today, this uh, Tupperware box full of bits is all I'm going to eat. I'm not going to eat any more than this Tupperware box. And stick to it. Do this for four days. And it'll be hell to begin with. But by the end of that four days, you've passed a certain threshold of pain. And you begin to tolerate hunger and even enjoy it. So that's, that's really what I've... What I did, I didn't put it all in the Tupperware box. I just managed to control and what I what I thought was, if I can just stay in this place of hunger that I feel in the pit of my stomach for four days, I'll be fine. And as my wife always says to me, as Brynn always says to me, when I tell her I'm hungry, she says, just eat off your fat reserves. And that's kind of what I did. And I've lost a heck of a lot of weight. I'm tempted to stand up and show you how much weight I've lost, but I don't know if you can tell from my face. Uh... And the other thing is, I don't know, um, I'm, I'm going to show you properly on another uh, video blog. If you hit each other again like that, yeah, but don't fight like that, please, okay? Uh, what we're going to do, what I'm going to show you is my, my waist and my belt, because already my belt is on the absolute lowest setting. Uh, and, I, and I don't have another hole. I need to get maybe a hole punch to put another hole in it, but... It's on the absolute lowest setting, and it's still it's beginning to fall off my ass again, which is a good sign. I'm going to a wedding in a week, so I'm determined to lose even more weight, and I'm going to England the very day before the wedding to buy a suit. The day before. That's how much I want to wait, so I've absolutely lost as much as I possibly can before the wedding so I can find a nice suit. Problem is, I'm going to continue to lose weight. So the suit will become defunct, but I might be able to sell it on uh, eBay. I'm not going to buy an expensive suit. I'll probably go to M&S and spend a 150 quid or 200 pounds or so, max. Anyway, so my diet has started, and maybe I will show you, actually. Just just have a look at this. Hold on. Um, I mean, I know, I know it doesn't look like I've lost some, a lot of weight, but I, I promise you I have lost a ton of weight. And, I've, and you can see I've still got a fair way to go. Okay, so Happy New Year, and I will be back to you soon. Bye, boys. Bye-bye. Say bye-bye, boys. Bye -bye. Say bye-bye, boys. Bye-bye. Say bye-bye, Siavash. Bye-bye, Siavash. Bye-bye, Siavash. That's not how you do it, but anyway.